This video is about white hair for spite.club. The pop-up uh, says please press the allow button to continue and also it displays some uh, alert claiming that it's some robot check and that you should click on the allow button to prove that you are not a robot. This information delivered by white half for spy.club is totally faulty and deceptive. Its mission is to hijack your browser with very intrusive ads that will be randomly attacking your device uh, after the allow button is mistakenly clicked. So we again strongly advise that you not proceed with uh, such faulty and misleading statements what you need to do is to disregard any tricky suggestions by such pop-up and you need to uh, do the following. First of all, let's uh, try to get rid of these pop-ups manually. Now, if the allow button was clicked, we need to uh, uh, cancel this uh, wrong action on our part. So we need to go to the browser menu, we click on settings, now we choose uh, site settings and we select notifications area. So carefully inspect the allow area. So if the button, if the allow button was clicked, that website uh, will be in this list. You will need to uh, remove it from this list. And also you need to uh, carefully inspect your available applications. And if you find some suspicious software, right click on it and move it to the trash. Uh, additionally, some adware type programs are, cannot be visually discovered, so I recommend that you perform a uh, scanning of your Mac with Combo Cleaner antivirus that you may get on this website combocleaner.com. So download the program and start it from the launchpad. Combo Cleaner initially comes as the trial version. But even in the trial mode, it has got some free features, disk cleaner, big files, or duplicates finder. But the end of ours is the part of the premium license only. You may select your preferred scan type. And now go back to the dashboard and click on Start Combo Scan button. This is the end of scanning by Combo Cleaner and Tavars. As you see, uh, so far 28 threads were found in our computer. Now, if you click on Review Results, you'll be able to see the detailed description of each thread. And, by the way, uh, their location will also be uh, provided. So what you can do is uh, go to the um, applications area of your Mac and uh, look for suspicious software and right click on it and move it to the trash. Also you may go to the exact location of each thread and delete one thread at a time and this will be manual removal of threads. Or you may remove all these threads automatically, however, with the premium license of the program.